Yeah. Good morning from the south side Anchorage. Finally do my first ice fishing with Chokia. Hi everybody. Good morning. Happy New Year. How long it is cold. It's cold. <laughs> How long have you been doing ice fishing? Uh, this is this is my second year doing it. Second year? I've only done it for like I mean like, I've only done like three outings so far, yeah. so this is gonna be my fourth one. So he has uh he has all the tent. I brought my heater, I brought my gears that I purchased. And we're on the south side. We're gonna tackle Sand Lake. I think it's about single digits right now, but we're all suited up. We got snow pants. I got extra layers of clothes. And uh, we have a tent with the heater, so that should keep us pretty warm. And uh, we're the only folks out here today. So let's go see if we can get something. You were here last weekend. You said it was yeah, pretty, was pretty hot. Yeah, on Monday. Yeah, so what are, we, what are you catching out here? Uh, they have stock trout, yeah. stock salmon, okay. Arctic char, and uh, grayling. I was nice. lucky to catch some Arctic char, but I want to get some trout and salmon. Is there any uh, pikes out here? Um, I'm not aware of. Nice. Today's pretty warm actually, or at least for me. So this lake is surrounded by houses. <laughs> it's pretty much surrounded by houses, so um, it doesn't have a lot of access point. This is one of the two access points that we know of. So good luck finding it. If you guys stay long enough, at the end of this video, I'll let you guys know how to access the access point that we're on. But look at all these mansions surrounding the lake here. Beautiful sunrise. So like I said, we're right here. This is our hole we're gonna go for. Hand crank auger. And this is where we came from. Quick five minute walk. This is the lake right here, Sand Lake. <coughs> so you were here, this spot was where you were here last week. Yep. Justify you going a couple trips, you know? Yeah. How much did they usually run? Like three to five hundred for a gas auger. Maybe you can find a used one, maybe? Yeah. <laughs> Alright, the hole's pretty much dug up. A good uh what? Yes. Oh yeah. Man, that's crazy. That thing's pretty good. That, yeah. The, 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 the hand auger. Yeah. yeah took, it, it works the same as the gas auger. Yeah, that took like less than took less than five minutes. So with the gas one, you get it like in one minute. Either. Yeah, in one minute. I want to catch some pike just for fun because I know. Oh pike man, are... you gotta go to Fire Lake. Where is Fire Lake? I heard uh, it's talking. a little bit before Mirror Lake. Before Mirror Lake? Yeah. Huh. I it's like a, also a. Is it in Chugia? I'm assuming. Yeah. Or... It's, it's also like a closed, like private property, lake shore uh -huh. houses. Uh -huh. So in the winter time, it's good to go, but in the summertime, you gotta have kayak. All right, guys. So I was thinking that we're gonna fish in one hole, but we're gonna do two holes because we have two fishing poles. I'm fishing and Truck is fishing. So right here is good, sir. Yeah. Hold it like this. Yeah. This way. You gotta kind of uh, either way. <laughs> you gotta break the ice. So there's no hole there. Just keep going. It'll shave it like a okay. ice cream shaver. <coughs> All right, here we go, guys. Let's see how long I take. Because that's the one that, yeah, swings. Okay, man. So you reverse it back. Yeah, reverse it back. Don't try to pull it out. Woo, so what is that? It went about that deep, guys. Well, that's like, shoot, that's like two feet. Two feet so this is pretty safe. Yeah. Much, yeah. very safe. Hey, how you do this by yourself? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> 
it's hella hard doing it one person. Okay, I see on this side. Oh. This is a pool style, guys. I'm gonna move the heater over. Here goes my first cast, everyone. My first ice fishing cast when using some uh, trout magnet from Wally World. I barely see the bait in there. I don't know. Oh, I can almost see it. I, oh, I see my bait in there. So apologize for the quality of the camera. We're in a dark space here, so we ain't got the best lighting, but this is what it is out here. Heat works good. We're nice and cozy. Our feet, our feet's not cold. Our hands not cold. We're five minutes into the trip. First cast, just letting it play around. The GoPro camera died already. What did you catch last thing? Arctic trout. Yeah, Arctic trout. Is that like? Is that similar to trout? Yeah, they they look like trout. Uh -huh. They're like uh, uh, specific to like the North Pole region. <coughs> You got one? Yep. Oh, we got a fish on. Right here, nice. Whoa! <laughs> what is Dude, this guy? that's fast. Yeah. This I, looks like I a... saw that. <laughs> Check that out. Our first fish. <laughs> Your first fish. First fish for 20. Nice. 20. Check that yeah. out. Landlocked salmon. Wow. Yeah. That's how this big. is the yep. landlocked salmon. Wow. So you, you can keep that one. Yeah. Man, great job right there. So, so what, which lure are you using? So let's check uh, This is a trout magnet. So you're using the the yellow and the yellow orange. yellow orange. Okay, so one right there. Check that out. We're gonna take us like this. We're we're like ten minutes into the <laughs> our first cast. Ten minutes and there goes our landlocked salmon. Yeah. We got about uh, eight inches or so, seven eight inches. It's breakfast time for these fishes, so we got the first salmon landlocked salmon coming in. These are called steelhead, right? When they're landlocked, or they just um, call it landlocked salmon. So they're chinook salmon, but they're the uh, what is the hatchery one? <coughs> the hatchery one. Oh. Yeah. That's so we call it landlocked. Did they get the size? Current time is 10:34. Got one of those. Um, I had a few bites, but then lost it. Didn't really focus too much and didn't set the hook. Uh, we still we're waiting for more fish to come through right now. We ended up putting some weights at the end of our line, and uh, that kind of helped drop it farther in. So our line's pretty deep in there right now. Trying different depths because I have heard that um, usually with the light bait it is more successful because it's natural, it's scented. I should have bought some shrimp yet. Yeah. Next time we'll bring some baby shrimps. Fish on again, second oh, one. Man, that's a nice one. Holy smoke! Ooh, that's a good one. What is that? Another. This is a char. I'll take char. Ooh, that's a nice one. Slow down, slow down, fishy. Looks like a salmon. Oh, mm. a landlocked salmon. Landlock, another oh, no, half? this is Arctic char. Arctic char. Yeah, you see the Whoa. spots on the yep. on the side right there. Yeah. Man, that's good. Okay, so that one was a what? With a swiggly? Yeah, you so, wanna you wanna try this setup? <laughs> so, uh, so I think you, it was like three feet under the three, feet under? Okay, three to five there. feet under the ice. So current time right now, I think it's eleven o'clock, guys. We've been uh, here for a couple hours. We weren't getting nothing at all. Guys, switching over to this setup, and hopefully we get something. Oh, it's nice and bright in there. It's way more brighter. It's, it's really dark in the water here. Yeah, it is. So the fish, I'm not sure how good they can see. So it's always nice to have something that's nice and bright. But right now, I can see my yeah. That one, it's a way bigger bait, and I, it's nice and bright, so I can see why. I can see it. Oh shoot, they're in there. You see it? Yeah. yeah. Oh. Guys, there's fish in there, guys. I can see the fish swimming around my... Around your bait? Oh, right there, right there. Oh, almost got it. <laughs> oh, dude, they're in there. Yep. Yeah. Okay. We got some action, guys. I can see the fish swimming around my bait now. Oh, yeah, they're in there. Let it, let it, let it pull it first. <laughs> they took you out. Yeah. I'll wiggle it around. So it's super dark in there a little bit, but you have, there's just a little bit of light in there. And um, 
I can see them swirling around me in my bait because my bait's nice and it's like almost like glow in the dark. Yeah, they're they're like going around around my bait right now. I'm just gonna slowly jiggle it up and down. Come on, fishy. Just waiting for a fish. Two fish so far. What do you think? <laughs> Pretty good or not? That's slow. <laughs> slow. Yeah. We had a few moves too. <coughs> I wish I can show you guys it. You guys can't really see it. Guys, I got a fish on. We we're just gonna get ready to chat and then I was talking too much. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> First fish right there. Whoa. <laughs> Don't let it fall back in. Yeah, the other day Check I had that. one that dropped in there. <laughs> That's crazy. Oh, let me get my towel. I brought a piece of towel to hold the fish so your hand doesn't get dirty. This time. Okay. Whoa. Okay. Uh, uh. Man. Got yourself one now. <laughs> okay, I finally got one. First after fish of the year. First fish for 2022. Took about, I think we're out here for what? Almost... 9.30? No, we start around 10. 10? Yeah, 10. Okay. So it's 11.21 right now. So about an hour and a half. Check that out. What is this? The Arctic char? Yeah, Arctic char. Arctic yeah. char guy. Look at that. They're using, they're eating on these guys right here. 11.26. I'm looking down my fishing hole. And there's a pretty big fish in there. I can't see. Don't know what it is though. But he was uh, circling my food. Like me, but he's not getting it. Jig it, jig it. Yeah. Oh, damn, right there. Almost, he just looks big, but maybe it's the size of this guy. <laughs> In there. Anything on your side? No. <laughs> Nothing. He's been quiet. Yeah. I'm about to change tackle in a second. Yeah, we might, we might just have to change bait here and there. Yeah. To see what you know, yeah. they're willing to. Uh, yeah, we tried the. I tried the white and yellow, and then bite. tried the orange one, and then I finally caught them. So the one I got was on. It wasn't mine. Uh, Chuka, he gave me some of these guys here, so I'm using his, and it works. Or at least it caught the one I got here. Well, I caught one on it, and then he also caught one on it too. Yep. The second one, second one was on that one. That second one is seven. The seven, right? Or is it char? Arctic char. Uh, Arctic char. Arctic char. Yeah. So we got. So we have two Arctic char and one Mylock salmon, that first one he got. So my impression on ice fishing is, yes, it's a very enjoyable winter sport. Um, definitely re recommend it for anybody that wants to do it. Um, it's definitely nice that we have the tent because I don't think, it, if we don't have the tent, I think it'd be very miserable, cold and chilly. And uh, definitely nice to have the heater out here too. Yeah, dude, I see a bunch of fish on my end. You don't see anything over there? Oh, yeah, I see them on my end, too. Yeah. Yeah, there's a school down there right now. Yeah, there's, there's a bunch of them right there. Just can't get it. I don't know if this, the bait's too big it's, or something. I think the bait's too big. I might switch, switch up again. Yeah, I'll keep them busy over here, and then you switch yours. Yeah. Yeah, I'll keep them distracted, or at least I'll keep them here. But I think switch up to the smaller <coughs> guy from earlier. Yeah, I'll, I'm not sure if this bait's too big. Or... This is crazy, guys. We have, like, a fishing hole right here but they're not eating it we could have been living out already there's like all over got one got one right there show sorry Chuck, Chuck, he just yeah, got one in there. he just got one yeah I, bro i think you should do the smaller one do the small ones yeah go back to the chop magnet because okay. i'm on the chop magnet go ahead reset yours reset yours and now uh yeah go just reset the no, well, put your fish, put, oh, put, your, oh. yeah, put your hook back in oh, there. Okay. Then, oh, to, to play with it? Yeah, to play with them, and then uh, once you're back in there, I'll go ahead and reset mine. Yeah, I think these hooks are too big, guys. The uh, the silver, the green one here. So we're going to go back to the trout magnet, the one that we originally used. I don't want to spook them. I guess they look big, but they're about the size right here. Six, eight inches, which is nice. He just try uh, try one of my uh, uh, green orange. Green orange? Yeah. Green orange. I don't think I have it. Yeah, just yeah. set it right there. I'll get it. Because yeah. I could see them. I yeah. can see them coming Dude, I, up. No, I see a bunch yeah. of them right now. They're like all over my hook, but they're not taking it because I think it's too big. 
bro. It's crazy. I'm just like waiting for a bite. No, they're all over my hook too, but yeah. they're not taking it. All right, I'm gonna reset mine real quick, guys. Round two, guys. We're going with this one. Yeah, it's just a little bit under the eyes. Come, uh, current time 11:40. We'll see how fast we can get it. Oh, this one's nice and bright. Oh yeah, I like to see my bait. Oh yeah, they're in there. They're still in there. Oh man, they're just swimming everywhere, guys. They got us. They got both of us, both of us, off off our chair. <laughs> We're sitting too much. Dude, they look so big, man. I wish you guys could see this, man. They're like, <laughs> they're literally right coming right at the bait, but they're not eating it or something. Yeah, you guys can't really see it, but man, they're like right at the bait. They're like all, they're like all tackling it, but not. It's like as if they, it's like as if they can't get their mouth open or something. Yeah, there's a bunch over here, dude. Clear some of this ice so I can see better. Oh, oh shit! You hear me, huh? Yo. Yeah, we got a whole school right here. They're like right there too. They're not deep. They're not. They're not far uh, down there. They're like right up. They're all tackling my bait right now, guys. So okay. cool. Gotta switch. This. What do you want to switch to? Uh, I got some um, spinners, little spinners. Does that work? I'm gonna try it for the first time. Try it, try it. I, I'll keep them here. Yeah. Keep them active. Dude, I want to catch one on camera for you guys, but they're taking a while, man. We can use live bait. We gotta use shrimp next time, dude. Yeah, if there's, if, shrimp, be like, yeah if, if there's if there's this mini fish in there, yeah, shrimp, I think they will bite. Current time is 12 p.m. Everyone, a bunch of fish are in the water right now, but for some reason they're just not taking our baits. These uh, trout magnets and trout eggs are not really hitting right now. A good school of them, about maybe, uh, I want to say at least five to six of them are in there. They're all swimming around, just not bugging our bait. They're gone right now, but they're still around nearby, I think. I switched back to a smaller hook, went with the orange one. Um, if you guys do ice fishing, let us know what you guys are using for bait. You guys use light bait, or what's your jig setup? So next time we can uh, hopefully hit more fish, we're gonna go, go back in the ice. Oh, do you hurry up, man? There's a lot in there. Yeah? Yeah, there's a lot in there. They're still all in there. Oh, hang out. Oh, shit. Oh, oh, got it, got it, got it, got it. Got it. Oh, it snapped it. Did it again? I set my hook too quick. Oh, well, maybe the smaller hook, guys. Maybe the smaller hook is the issue. Or the bigger hook was the issue. I saw one of these spoon. I was shopping for my gear, and I'm like, man, you don't need that. <laughs> but man, it does. It's 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 definitely much needed. I'm glad you have one. Yep. Yeah, because you gotta clear up your hole here, because over so, time it'll start to freeze up, and over so, time the yeah. ice comes up. So yeah, if you guys are ice fishing, make sure you have one of these little spoon thingy. Last year I got into ice fishing late, so they're like sold out. I had to go to like oh, yeah? you know, Walmart's, um, you know, like kitchen. Uh, yeah. A kitchen um oh utensils yeah. and i just use one of those yeah that works too yeah, yeah you what but this those? year i was like yep i gotta get one yeah you can use a kitchen what is it, one of those spoon strainers yep. spoon strainers if uh worst case or no you don't can't find one but this year there's plenty of ice fishing gear that's the sportsman's warehouse uh -huh. and didn't really see much stuff at walmart but um, you should... and after that probably try uh go back to truck magnet for like the last you know yeah, so, so I'm just using trout magnet. Drops. <coughs> trout magnet here. Um, got this at Walmart. The kit right here I got was about 25 bucks. So if you guys uh, if you guys got something better, man, let us know in the comments. Oh, almost had it. Oh, dang, got off. It hooked it for sure, but it got off. Damn. See, this is this is fun when you can see them. <laughs> see them and you're toying around with them. Oh, I got one, dude. What the heck? 
I got one this whole time. Oh, <laughs> sure. Right there. Ooh. He's so small I couldn't feel the weight of it. But look at that. Right there. All right. All right, baby. Let me get my towel here. Ooh, ooh, oh, you got one? Yep. yep. All right, okay. Back to back. Oh, ooh, that's a big ooh. one. <laughs> that's a big one. Check that out. Check that out, guys. Back to back right there. <laughs> it came off. It's, it's all good. It's all good. It's yeah, all good. It's all good. It's not going anywhere. It's not going anywhere. They're back. They're back to back. Get back in there. So you just went, he just set up, uh, Chucky just set up his new rig, his new jig, and he got it. So what is this? A little char? Uh, Arctic char. Arctic yeah. char. All right, so two Arctic char for me. Back to back. Back to back. They're still in there. They're still in there. Oh, they're still in there, too. Nice. All right, guys, we got back to back, and I was using the orange one. Oh, that's a nice one. Oh, they're still in there. Yep, they're all over. <laughs> Dude, you threw your in there, and then you got it right away. Yep, just like yeah, fifteen seconds. So Chalk, he threw his right in there. Right, right when I got mine, he threw his, and then boom, he got his. They're just really. They're messing around right now. It's like they're hungry, but they're not hungry. Or they want to hit it, but they don't want to hit it. So the one I'm using right now is an orange one. So anything that's bright, I'm assuming they like it. Oh, there it is, right there. They're showing. They're showing. What? Right there. Oh. <laughs> so this is an Arctic char again. Another Arctic char. Check that out, guys. It's about the same size as the other one. Look at that. Three Arctic Char. Okay, so they're not that big, man. The yeah, beast. they're, they're yeah, they they, size. They, current time is 12.15, guys, so been hour for about two hours, I won't say. And the hook size that I'm using is just the one I came with the uh, trout magnet kit here, so I might have to get some new hooks and get a different jig set up. Oh, right here, fish on. Oh, it's a fish on. Oh, it's a, woo! I saw Whoa, this one. Oh, that's a nice one. Oh, yeah. I saw this one tackle it. Look at that, guys. Another one. I got, what, four? I think it's five, five's our limit, right? Yeah, five's the limit. Five's the limit. So I got one more to limit out. I Check one, that. Two, three, four. All right, man. I, I literally thought I wasn't going to catch one today or anything <laughs> at all, but that's what an Arctic char looked like, right? Man, they're nice. Look at that. Sweet. So if you guys are ice fishing, man, definitely commit at least two hours, three hours to be on the lake. Um, unless you have a little nice honey hole where you're going to limit out in 30 minutes. But um, definitely plan for at least an hour or two to be out here. Oh, they're right there. Right there. Get it. Oh, he almost took it. Got it? Oh, no. Came off. So I'm, using, I'm using the orange one, guys. Damn, I think I'm going to go back to the trout magnet. Yeah, go back to the trout magnet. Because it's too big. Yeah, yeah, those are way too big, I think. It'd be nice to get like a big size trout, but <laughs> we know that's not going to happen. Got one? Yep. Fish on, right there. Whoa, that's a big one. Check that out. <laughs> Dude, that's a nice one. Yeah, that's a good, decent size right there. Look at that. Man, beautiful Arctic char. So, oh, yeah, you just went on, you just put on a trout magnet, right? Yeah, I just put it on. Man, that's quick. Well, at least it's good. we got something, man. For a second, I thought we weren't gonna get nothing. Let's take some time and patience, guys. Fishing is all about patience. Got a nice Arctic char. I'm out here with Nutty Noon. Hello. Um, we kind of thought we were gonna skunk for a minute, but <laughs> the fish started biting, so we're in a good spot right now. This is the honey hole. This is your honey hole. I got orange and yellow out right now. The orange and yellow uh, trout magnet, we call it. He just threw it in. He got one already. Look at that one. Yeah, that's, that's a nice. big one, dude. I'm done. <laughs> that's a nice one. Show that one to the camera right here. Yeah. yeah right there. Guys, for a second, I thought we were gonna skunk, but I started picking up. I, I, I thought I'm using the same one like yours. Is that, is that, I mean, if... See if you can get it. Oh, 
you guys can see my hook right there. You guys see the fish, guys? There it is right there. I want you guys to see the fish. They're up like right there. That yellow thingy there is my hook and my bait. Right there. There goes another one right there. Right there, all the fish. I just lost oh, my last fish. That was a nice one. I just lost my last fish. I was, I went to hit the camera record. If I didn't do that, I would have got it probably, but it's all good. You'll get another one. You'll get another one. You gotta be quick, guys. If you don't, uh, you're not quick, they're gonna unhook themselves and they're gonna jump right into the ice hole here. Oh, damn, I took it already. Mm. <laughs> I didn't even see it. I was looking for my bait. I was like, oh shit, where'd it go? Look at that one. Oh shit, that's another yeah, one. Yeah, that's quick. Another one. Oh, dude. Oh. Unhook itself. Oh, again. So we ended up getting five fish each. They're all frozen. So the trip turned out to be really good. These are the two ice holes that we were fishing at within each other. We're gonna go ahead and wrap it up right now. It's about maybe, we started around, uh, we started at 10 p.m., 10 a.m. and it's 12.45 p.m. right now. So it's been about a couple of hours out here. Not bad at all for a good day of fishing. First time ice fishing in Alaska. Let me know if you guys have any tips. It turns out to be colder than we expected. We were inside that tent and it was really nice and cozy, but I guess when we got out and started packing up, Man, it's super chilly. My ears, my nose, getting frozen. I hope you guys enjoy this ice fishing trip. Let me know if you guys have any comment tips. So yeah, shout out for you to taking me out here today. Uh, could have done it without him. He has all the gears and he knows the spot, the honey hole. <laughs> we got our limit and uh, we're gonna go try these fish out. See if they taste good. And maybe next time we'll uh, bring you guys along for another trip bring out some more different baits and stuff like that so we'll catch you guys on the next video peace out have a great time with nothing new Woo. <laughs>